My mother was the first person to teach me Spanish. When I was six, barely speaking English at the time, she would turn on a Spanish language cartoon to teach me basic vocabulary. We'd listen to Pimsleur CDs in the car while running errands, and we'd speak Spanish to each other at the dinner table. My mom has always viewed language learning as essential to my growth from childhood to now. She taught me that learning a new language breaks down barriers, builds bridges, expands the mind, and opens the heart. So when I got to high school and found out that I had community service requirements, I knew that I wanted to do something to help Spanish speakers. When my mom found the opportunity to volunteer at his Fuentes, we jumped at the chance. I say we because we have been partners on this journey. I'm happy that we've been able to find an opportunity that is meaningful and beneficial, not just an activity to get a grade or to pack a resume or skate through some schoolwork without any real effort. Six Point Face has been a labor of love, except it has not been a labor at all. It has just been love. I think all the teachers who teach there will tell you being at Six Point Face is a joyful ending to a stressful day. And I'm not exaggerating when I say I get as much from them, if not more, than they get from me. Six Point Place is truly a blessing in my life. I go to a private school, so a lot of the time I don't live in the real world. That makes Six Point Place that much more important to me. Because Six Point Place is real. It's real people, real kindness, real struggles, real joy, real emotional support, real heart, it's the real world. And I'm going to quote my mom again, you can only get real love in the real world. Seis Puentes is real love. It's the chipperness of Anna, and the curiosity of Joel, and the steadfastness of Ramon, the sauciness of Glenda, the determination of Brian, the sweetness of Katie, the compassion of Miss Lisa and Miss Audrey, the generosity of Miss Leticia, and the heroics of Raul holding it all together. Everyone who spends time there, anyone who spends time there, makes up the heart of Seis Puentes. They have become like family. So on behalf of all the students who have trusted me and tolerated my bad Spanish and kept returning, often for the fellowship, who have literally come to class in the icy rain with inadequate clothing and exposed feet, it is on their behalf that I say thank you.